Aquaculture is defined as farming a species via fresh or salt water. It is a method that uses Earth's naturally occurring oceans or fresh water. With the growing population, it is a great way to use less ground space. In some cases, the aquaculture species use the natural nutrients from the ocean or fresh water. Aquaculture is a growing trend worldwide and there are many different ways and techniques to aquaculture species. Mahi Mahi is a prime candidate for aquaculture, but there will need to be a few initial investments. Like every other food production in the world, there will need to be time, money, research, and many other resources invested into the production. One of the biggest costs will be the cage. This will be the first investment to make mahi-mahi and aquaculture species. This enclosure will need to be altered for this fish because they are known for jumping out of the water. High fences above the water line are needed. The cages would cost a few thousand dollars to build. The next cost would be getting the first round of larvae, embryos, egg and sperm to be fertilized later. These juvenile mahi-mahi need to be put into tanks since they would be too small to stay within the adult cages. After they reach sexual maturity, mahi and mahi will be able to reproduce for the following generations. Food pellets or fish meal will be fed to the mahi mahi will also need to be included in the total cost. There will need to be floats and anchoring lines for the cage. Five reasons why mahi mahi satisfies aquaculture. Reason number one, these fish will reach sexual maturity and they will reproduce fairly quickly. It only takes about six months. Reason two, employers will use the ocean as a free natural resource to make home to the aquaculture mahi-mahi. Reason three, this will be big savings on water and filtering compared to other aquaculture structures such as tanks. Reason 4. Easily movable cages will make it possible to change locations for the species if the water quality diminishes. Reason 5. The cage structure will not need any moving or mechanical parts so there will be small room for error with the cage malfunctioning. Some possible issues with aquaculture using ocean cages are poachers stealing fish from the cage illegally. Severe weather conditions such as high winds and waves can detach the cage from anchor points or possibly break the cage. This can be catastrophic for a company since it can destroy their equipment or the crop. Biofouling on the cage is another possible issue. This makes it difficult to keep the cage clean and will also increase the weight of the cage and put more stress on the anchoring points, floats, and the cage itself. Diseases or parasites can occur within Mahi Mahi which cause a loss of crop and profit for the company. These can spread throughout the population quickly. If the water quality changes or gets worse, it can have an effect on the health of mahi-mahi. Here are a few more reasons on why mahi-mahi are suitable for aquaculture. Their fillets make up a delicious gourmet meal that is served in restaurants all around the world. This will help with the growing need for food on earth as the population will continue to grow. Mahi-mahi is a good fish to include in the diet because it is lower in calories and fat intake is also an excellent source of protein, potassium, and vitamin B. This food source can also help with the obesity epidemic that is occurring within the United States by replacing fattening foods with healthier solutions. Having mahi-mahi in aquaculture will help alleviate the pressure for the wild population and still let fishermen enjoy catching the common dolphin fish, which is a sport word for this species. Success of aquaculture crops is measured by if the species produces positive revenue and is successful within the marketplace. Another way to measure success is if the profits outweigh the time and effort put in by employees to take care of the fish over the six months. If the equipment and maintenance costs are also being covered by the sales. If the company can make strong business connections with restaurants and fish markets to have constant business throughout the year. Most importantly is if the product is well desired by consumers. In conclusion, the world's population is going to increase from here on out. There will be a need for other ways to grow food. More resources are going to have to be implemented into our society. As good as burgers taste, 
it will take a lot of work and resources to grow cows until they get slaughtered. But Mahi Mahi has a 6 month turnover rate compared to the 18 months for cows. Let's change the world one fish fillet at a time. Uh, girl, you as quick as you all have to. So you're... Mahi Mahi. The name's so nice, you say it twice. I kinda like it, Fatso. I'll see you around, girl.